Guys like having something to chase. Guys want to work for something. If it's easy to them, they'll treat it like something that's easy, like come and go accessible. Even during the relationship, you don't want to be like that. Make your life so interesting without him. Go off of your phone for a few hours. Let him wonder what you're doing. I hate to break everyone's heart, but nobody wants somebody to chase. This is exactly why the men this, women that advice all over TikTok, all over social media is just silly. Nobody, no matter what their gender, likes somebody to chase. If you're making somebody chase you, what you're actually doing is triggering abandonment wounds. And what triggering somebody's abandonment wounds is going to do is create a clingy partner that you are going to label clingy, that you're going to label codependent. You're going to feel suffocated and you're going to blame them for it. But in actuality, it's your fault. Dismissive avoidance is low-key emotional abuse. It is not a game to play. If somebody likes you, they'll put an effort. It's that simple. You don't need to play games with somebody who likes you. We don't need to manipulate people into liking us. Do they make an effort or not? We do not want to mentally abuse somebody into submission. And that's all a hot and cold game is. And also, at least as a man, while we're splitting genders, men do not see you as easy for making an effort in a relationship. They see you as easy based on your availability to other men. And I can't speak for women, but I'm only guessing women feel the exact same way about their man. How accessible are they to other women? Nobody likes that. Nobody likes an accessible partner. We got to stop splitting genders. There's no magical thing to do to make men like you specifically other than be a good person and other good people are going to like you. It's that simple. I tell anybody with a good heart that wants to do the manipulation games the same thing. It doesn't matter how intelligent you are. It doesn't matter if you study giraffes your entire life. You can never be more of a giraffe than a giraffe is. It's the same with avoidant. It's the same with a narcissist. You cannot out narcissist a narcissist. You cannot out avoidant an avoidant because you're miserable the entire time. They are not. They love it. It's relief to them. Let's just date healthy people who are ready for a connection instead.